Okay, in this part, you will learn how to read and write RFID tags with this demo. Okay. Here you may see a tag count and interval and the read interval you can set in as 10 milliseconds or 255 milliseconds. It also has the has other options are filters and uh, decimal for Wigan 26 and reading clear export and this is uh, operation zone and this is tag information zone where they show the tag numbers time and EPC length and antenna numbers count and RSI value if the reader has these functions and this part is is right is right functions and it's allow user to fast speed to fastly write EPCs as its own. And here is the fast write EPCs in hex. And uh, there is the increment which is uh, how to add one after write a tag. And this buttons uh, if you check this button then you don't need to uh, always click the first click this button and it will out to uh, write the EPC after one uh, tag is written and this and this part is for the Wigan 26 uh, within 26 writings if you want to write to 10 digits uh, decimals Right, uh, ID text, then you can just just using the second one, but the use rail is rarely used in normal, uh, in normal applications. And this zone is detail read write functions, and you may you can just uh, write EPCs with the memories TID, uh, read read TIDs or write EPCs with the memories use map use the memories here. And a starting address and length, access password, and write, and this is the write date in hex. Okay. And this is the reading, reading date. Okay. And this reader do not support lock functions. So it is disabled lock. It disabled. And which means that you cannot lock the PCs. And uh, reserve memory, which is which the access password and killing passwords uh, existed. So do not support lock functions for this E series readers. Okay. Now let's that's an uh, operation. Okay. Now I click reading. Okay. I put two tags on the USB UHF RFID reader and it got two I two IDs, especially one this one and this one. Okay. So if I and it just uh, read it reads uh it just uh, turn the reading EPC IDs and EPC lens antenna and it comes. If just uh, uncheck the filters, okay, you just uh, show the turn section where it's reading, okay. You will just uh, read, show each time of readings, oh, like this one. See that? Okay. So sometimes if in multiple readings we you in multiple text readings we normally check this filter box. Okay. Okay, stop. And this function is for Wigan 26 format readings. Sometimes if sometimes in the access control fields, mm, the access controller will just fetch the 10 decimal IDs. So in access control systems, 
especially the reading a reader connected to the access controller you need to you sometimes you need to check this one to convert convert tag ID to Wigan 26 format okay let's check what will be going on okay uh, especially and uh, this this options is only effective for EPC ID of eight hex okay this this is affecting this is not affection this has no affection because it only identified eight digits so I just uh, show what it is reading see that okay so this tag has been changed to uh, change the ID to this one and this has no factions as 20 24 hex means 96 bit uh, EPCs so if I just okay see that so as this as to this you can also then check how it convert to decimal within 26 and this hex 41 3 2 and 5 and decimal is like this okay I just check this box and reading again okay see that so this is Wigan 26 10 digit see the 10 digit okay this tags the tags can be export to the Excel or textbook by click these buttons for example I just uh, I just uh, uh, installing the desktop and rename okay sample okay now I just click the sample Excel so this is EPCs and the time a reading and the second second one second chips okay so this is exporting functions okay then this fast writing functions I will just introducing the next chapter next part okay thanks for watching